East military families voiced their concerns to U.S. Senator Tom Tillis today. Tillis paying a visit to Marine Corps Base Camp Lejeune this morning to speak about housing issues. Now your side's Camila Barco is in our Jacksonville studio tonight with more. Camila. Among the issues of concerns is the state of military housing and the amendment to rename Lejeune High School to honor the late Walter B. Jones. Tillis weighed in on the controversial topics. Military families greet U.S. Senator Tom Tillis aboard Camp Lejeune Tuesday morning. The senator took the stage to listen to service members and their spouses about current living conditions. Some of the circumstances we heard today by every measure were unacceptable. This summer, Tillis voted to improve housing under the National Defense Authorization Act for the 2020 fiscal year. Senator Tillis' priorities under the legislation include a tenant bill of rights, an increase in health and hazard inspections, and additional funding to strengthen military housing management. The senator says his team will take action on situations left unanswered. Oh, we all want to help, but we don't know what we don't know. Tillis proposed the idea of an app allowing military homeowners to rate their experience on housing service requests. Feedback that will make sure the communication back to the housing providers and to the command is as fast as possible. Also, students stood in unity to preserve Lejeune High School's name. This is after a California congresswoman proposed an amendment to rename the school after the late Walter B. Jones. Senator Tillis responded with, um, who all agrees with the, the bill, and nobody raised their hand, so I think that was obviously a very clear representation of how everybody feels about it. Tillis responded, Congressman Jones deserves to be honored in some way. Um, I think that we need to find a way to where we can continue to honor the tradition of the Marine Corps which, and then find an appropriate way to honor Congressman Jones. Tillis is scheduled to make multiple appearances in Pitt and Martin County tomorrow. Live in Jacksonville, Camila Barco, 9 on your side. Camila, thank you.